Hi, in this session I am going to show how to use Google Analytics connector in Power BI desktop. Open Power BI desktop and click get data and choose online services and here you can see Google Analytics. Choose Google Analytics and click connect. So actually this is the connector which comes from a third party services. So it is not that direct connector from Google to Microsoft it is using a third party services so we are not uh, guarantee actually Microsoft is not guaranteed that we are ge going to get the perfect results from Google Analytics still it is a connector that we can connect our Google Analytics from Power BI desktop so we don't have any other option to play the Google Analytics data in Power BI desktop so we have to accept this information and we need to click continue so I have connected uh, my Google Analytics so it is going to ask you your Google email address and password so your email address and password is correct then it is going to show all your Google Analytics so here I have uh, analytics on my website that is nothing but data BI visuals so under uh, my website it is going to show all my uh, cubes measures and dimensions so these are the dimensions and measures so I can choose whatever I want I can get the data into Power BI desktop and I can start building the report so I have another channel uh, with another uh, account for Google Analytics that is uh, my YouTube channel so here under YouTube channel it has it is just like a cube it has dimension measures on it okay for example if i go to users i can see these are the measures and these are the dimensions so i can select whatever the data i want to visualize in my power bi desktop i can choose that so here i just selected a dimension if you see this warning message google analytics requires that at least one measure to be specified because we are not going to play only with the dimension so we need a message to play with the data or a visual so I have to choose any one of these users so once I selected here you can see so it, it has taking the data as a table format so if I load this it is going to load into the power bi desktop so uh, I just want to take a uh, few more uh, dimensions alright and the count of sessions alright so for a simple visualization this data is sufficient so I'll click load so it is go going to load that data into power bi desktop and you can see the queries or fields under this field section alright so these are the fields which we selected uh, from Google Analytics uh, cube like uh, measures and dimensions here uh, summation symbol shows that it is a measure and this is also a measure rest of the things are dimensions alright we can just create a simple visual like uh, we'll see what are the data are there so under uh, user type we have new visitor and the returning visitor and uh, we can choose the number of users on each user type so new visitor 145 returning visitor 87 and they have allocated a bucket for uh, these things and we'll see what else we have days since count of sessions so we'll just create a simple visual on these data so as we have only two data under user types so so we have more uh, new users and the returning user is less so we can just create a simple visuals like uh, connecting the google analytics and choosing the right dimensions and measures and start building the visuals so rest of the things like uh, drill down other features are same so this video is to show how to connect google analytics into power bi desktop please subscribe for more videos like uh, to discuss about uh, different connectors that we can use in power bi desktop and how to get the data from those different connectors thank you